Ó. What's going on guys? This is Eric here with the Get Me Out of Here vlog. And today I am going skiing at Devil's Head Ski Resort near the Wisconsin Dells. First time I have ever been here. It's a beautiful day out for some great skiing. Let's go check out the slopes. There's a guy in a Lakers jersey. He's repping LeBron James, but I think his spirit is in the right place. <laughs> All right, so I'm here at Devil's Head Ski Resort. It's a little bit confusing when you leave the parking lot. There's a building with a bar with some ticket sales, but all the windows are closed. And they directed me to the main office building, which is located over here. So I'm trying to get some ski rentals today. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. Looks like ticket rentals are this way down these stairs. I guess this place is attached to a hotel and resort, so it makes it a little more confusing. I'm walking into here. Okay, there's a line here, so I'm guessing this is the right place. Tickets. We're all the way back here. We're back here behind this abominable snowman. Yes. Oh, he, he denied me. I've been rejected by the abominable. <laughs> There it is. Can I get a pound? Yes, there it is. We're all ready to ski today. That's uh, that's a good luck charm. I'm not gonna break my legs today. Even the Yeti has to rent skis here. All right, first go at Devil's Head, doing the green. I'll get the GoPro out later. See if I'm better than I was last month. Probably not. All right. Well, I got one green in and it feels great. It's good to get out here at Devil's Head. This is the first time I've ever been to this ski resort and it's beautiful out. It's just very, very hot. Uh, the coat I've got is a heavy winter coat and it's like 35 degrees Fahrenheit out. So I'm starting to sweat it up underneath this. But the more I get down the slopes, the better the, the breeze and everything's gonna feel. So I'm gonna try to get in as much skiing as I can here. I'm with a few friends. A couple of them are, believe it or not, even a level below I am as far as the beginner <laughs> beginners go. Um, so they're actually still halfway down this green. I'm gonna see if I can't get up to the top of this and down one more time and meet them on the bottom. But it's great to get out. I'm still a total newbie when it comes to skiing. Uh, before last month, it'd been 18 years since I've been out, but it feels fantastic. So I'll see if I, you know, I might be able to make it up to a couple blue diamonds today or blues, black, I guess diamonds are black, but a couple blues. So we'll see how it goes. Again, I'm trying to uh, hopefully get the uh, GoPro out later today and give you guys some POV action. So we'll see how this goes. This is me just hanging out on the forklift for the chairlift. I work construction forklift chairlift. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys at the top. Check out this view on top of the hill. Look at that. Wisconsin, you're beautiful. On the bunny hill, they have this conveyor belt system. I have never seen one of these before. I think I'll stick to the chairlift, but this is pretty nice for beginners. What the heck is going on here? We got some mascots. <laughs> some characters for the bunny hill, apparently. Now, just to be clear, I haven't been on the bunny hill at all this entire time, I swear, just because I'm getting a lot of video of it. I haven't been on it. I've been hitting the greens up. If I'm feeling good today. I'm going to hit a blue up in a sec. Man, these furries are everywhere. Stuff that gives you nightmares. 
Apparently it's for the kids. I don't know about that. All right. So I haven't wiped out yet today, which is great. In fact, I've improved a month ago. I could barely get past the greens. Today I'm able to do a lot of blues, the blue squares. Been doing a lot of those today, getting the carving down better as well. We've been out there for about three hours, so we're gonna stop and get a beer. And then we're gonna be back out in the slopes and I'm gonna bring the uh, GoPro. I'm gonna have a chest strap with the GoPro because the helmets here do not have the GoPro connections. So I'll have the GoPro with me. I'm gonna take you down a couple slopes. One is gonna have some obstacles. We'll see if I can get some air time. Just a little advice for anybody here. They do not serve beer or alcohol in the main cafeteria. So you need to walk to this building that says Avalanche on the side. That's where they serve beer and drinks. I totally forgot about Spotted Cow. If you're in Wisconsin, Spotted Cow is one of the best regional beers in the world. Look at the cow. It's in New Glarus. It's so good. All right, I had my beer and I'm ready to hit the slopes again. I feel like I'm in the Terminator movies the way I'm walking here. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> All right, we're ready to hit the slopes again. I've got the GoPro on. So uh, I'm gonna either show you guys some epic downhill skiing or some amazing wipeouts. I haven't fallen yet today, so I think now that I got the GoPro on, I'm gonna fall. It's gonna happen. There's no avoiding it. So what do you guys think? Should I do this? This doesn't look like much in the camera, but this is a black diamond here in the Wisconsin Dells. I haven't been down that one yet, but I just did the... Maybe you can't see from this angle. It's a bad angle. There's an obstacle one. I'm going to use the GoPro and show you uh, show you that in a sec. I'll try to get some air time. Don't expect much. Okay. This is the obstacle course right down here. It's probably like a blue, if anything. But there's a few humps that I can get some jumps on. So, hump to jump. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm going to see. I'll try to get a small little, small little pounce on there. Again, I'm not a professional by any means. But uh, I got the GoPro, so you'll see what happens here. Oh man. All right. Jeez, I almost don't even need my glasses anymore. Fancy jump. That was nice. Nice air time there. Huh. Can't even get my skis. Oh, more for two now. Dude, I had no idea there was like a jump on that. Whoa, holy sh...
Oh, bad. Give up. Oh. Ha. Yeah. Did you see that? <laughs> You, say. you guys already saw the footage, I'm sure. <laughs> I swear, I did this like an hour ago without the GoPro. So of course I break out the GoPros when I wipe out hardcore. But I just did that obstacle run like an hour ago with no problem. I even jumped up off one of those things, got like a foot of air time. And I guess the footage speaks for itself. I absolutely got my ass kicked. You gotta go fast. <laughs> I got annihilated on this last one. I wiped out at least three times. Man. All right, we're going up for another though, but I think I need something basic this time to feel like, to leave this place with my head up, with my chin up in the air, with my head held high. Boy. All right, we got one more run. Put it on like speed. Prodigy. Yeah. That's, uh, that's copywritten music, man. I can't. Yeah, it might be. Well, I could, you can do any song you want as long as the the person that owns the rights to the song doesn't like complain to you and, and they rarely do because it's like advertisement for them right unless your video is like super offensive yeah yeah all right oh man this is a beautiful view it can't look like it's like a river it might be yeah all right we're doing the black diamond
do some carving. Take it nice and easy. Almost had that. <laughs> Made it. All right. All right, well, I survived the black diamond. That was my first black diamond. I know it's the Midwest, it's not Colorado, but it's a black diamond here in the Midwest. Anyway, I made it down. I just did a, a slight sliding wipeout. Nothing serious, I got that on camera. You guys probably saw that already. Okay, this is my last one of the day. This is a blue. I need to redeem myself here because the last two hills I got annihilated on. So I gotta try to make it all the way through. let the people go. Nice and easy, man. All right, I made it. I made the last hill down and I didn't fall. I conquered that thing. The blue square at the end. I can tell my legs are just tired. So that's it. The sun's going down. We're gonna call it. But this is an amazing ski resort. All right, this is Devil's Head. And here is a map of all the hills here located in the Wisconsin Dells.
the camera's a little shaky. I have a major adrenaline rush going on right now. I'm kind of happy that I didn't fall on that last blue, so I'm gonna call it a day on that. All right, well I wiped out hardcore on the black diamond. Not so bad on the black diamond, but big time on that obstacle course, which I did earlier today without any problem. But anyway, I ended the day on a positive note, went down one of the blues, didn't fall. Here's Devil's Head. So guys, I'm tired, I've been skiing all day. We'll be making, I'll be making more ski trips this winter, it's only February. I feel like there's not a, vlog, a lot of vloggers online that do winter time things, especially in the Midwest. So I'm gonna take advantage of that and show off some fun things you can do in the winter time in the Midwest. Anyway, thanks for watching. This is Eric, and now it's time for me to get out of here. All right, some advice about skiing is you're gonna fall. It's hard to get these boots off, but, but you're gonna fall. You need to fall. It's the only way you're gonna grow as a skier, and I suppose a snowboarder too, is don't just stay on the greens. I mean, feel confident, get your you know confidence up and have composure with being able to slow down, you know, cross your toes, be able to have control. But you're not gonna grow if you don't challenge yourself and hit the harder hills. And you're gonna fall down, but you're gonna get back up, which is really hard to do on skis, but you have to manage anyway. And then you're gonna do it again, and you're gonna do it again, and you're gonna do it again, and you're gonna do it again. And if you have a GoPro like me, you'll get really awesome footage of yourself wiping out. And uh, I'm still walking, I didn't break a leg, so it's a good day, it's a good day today. How about you? How it's did my you first do? time at it, and I did awesome, I think, right? You did amazing. Yeah. yeah. High five on that, <laughs> five. you did amazing today. All right, so a little advice. That doesn't stop people from Wisconsin. That guy's wearing shorts. Alright, so we grabbed a bite to eat in Madison, Wisconsin, and if you're here, you have to go to Ian's Pizza and get the best macaroni and cheese pizza on the planet. Mac and cheese pizza it is. It's amazing.